Hey everyone, Mike Sherry here with Sherry 4 x I have got an awesome limited edition lifted Jeep Wrangler to show you today. This is an all new 2023 in the rain, rain purple limited edition color. We only get a couple of these limited edition colors every year. Last year we had the Tuscadero pink. This year we got the rain purple and boy is it awesome. Now this Jeep is equipped with the uh, Rocky Ridge uh, K2 package on it, which gives you the 37 inch tires, 20 inch wheels, three inch suspension upgrade, and a lot more customized uh, stuff on this Wrangler. Uh, all of it's backed by Jeep's uh, warranty and Rocky Ridge's warranty. Rocky Ridge partners with Jeep and they have for quite a while. So Jeep says, yeah, you can do some really awesome stuff to our Jeep and we'll back it up just as much as you guys back it up. So pretty, pretty awesome package there. Uh, Rocky Ridge, to my knowledge, is the only one out there that has that uh, uh, authority to do that with brand new Wranglers. So pretty cool. Uh, on top of that, this also has some really cool options that are hard to get from Jeep. And the main one being the Sky One Touch uh, Power Top option. Uh, I know it's expensive. It's like over $5,000 for that option, but I don't think I'd own a Wrangler without it. It's really cool. So, and they made some improvements that I noticed just driving this over here to do the video. So let's go ahead and get started here. Let's first off, take a look. See that soft touch and power top. And they even paint right here, the edge that you see there. That's not the black plastic. And this paint is beautiful. It's got some nice sparkles in it. Uh, this has got the uh, uh, Rocky Ridge emblem up there in the center of the windshield. Uh, the simulated vented hood here, the satin black uh, grill insert here and then Rocky Ridge upgrades the bumper here to the a steel powder coated stubby bumper uh, has a 30 inch LED integration uh, trail light in it and then uh, here it's stubby bumper so it's not a full length bumper that allows this big wheel and tire to climb over objects and off-road purposes uh, instead of the bumper bumping into it they even paint the uh, tow hooks here in the rain and then you got your big skid plate up front here and then check out the the detail. They're artists, really, there at Rocky Ridge. See the coil spring and linkages all in that uh, Tuscadero, or not the Tuscadero, the rain. And then you got two steering stabilizers on this that they add, three inch suspension lift, Fox shocks, four play, 20 inch wheels wrapped in BF Goodrich. Those are 37 inch mud terrain tires. Those tires perform awesome off road and they really, really do good on road too. There's your Fox shock there. Fox Shocks is actually the parent company of Rocky Ridge. So they design and implement shocks and lift systems just for Rocky Ridge. Amp power running board there. Leather seats in here, check those out. I got the top shut. We'll open it when we get to the uh, driver's seat. Uh, power uh, soundboard up here. Let's see your Fox Shock back here. Rocky Ridge upgrades the rear door hinge and tire mount to allow for the same size wheel and tire to be mounted on the back. When you see a lot of people do this themselves, they oftentimes just leave the spare off, which I don't know what they do when they get it flat. Or it's got the factory smaller tire and rim, which just really looks dorky when you put bigger wheels and tires on your Wrangler. So the reason they do that is because the factory mount just can't support it. So the Rocky Ridge uh, partners with Smittybilt and uh, they upgrade that mount. They relocate the third brake light and the backup camera so everything still works. And really, I, I say this a lot, but I think the door works better with that Smitty built than it does with the factory Jeep hinge there. So a wiper and defrosting rear window. Uh, you got your center cap for your spare wheel, and then that is your protector for the LED light bar. Rocky Ridge gives you some goodies in the bag there, and then inside this plastic bag is a um, uh, just a vinyl bag. That that would be for if you had the T-tops in this Jeep, but this is got the power top, so you just got a goodie got a goodie bag from Jeep there. <laughs> this has got the Alpine subwoofer in it, power outlet. Notice how the roll cage and everything's painted in that rain. I keep wanting to say Tuscadero. Sorry for the times I said that. That's a cool color. Finding scene is available on this. We can make it super easy. Uh, we partner with all the major banks out there, or most of them, I should say, over 20. Uh, so if you're looking for the best rate and term and uh, don't want to spend days on end talking to banks, uh, we can do it for you in about five minutes. So figure out who's got the best rate and term for you. Again, they upgrade the seats to this really nice leather seat, honeycomb stitching in it. 
Uh, fully adjustable seat, this is your lumbar, this is your up and down, and this is your recline for the back portion of the seat. Uh, I get the question sometimes, well, why doesn't Jeep offer a power seat? Because they don't. Uh, well, the reason is for the water forwarding ability, right? They put power in the seat, this Jeep's not going to be able to go uh, into that deep of water. And it's really easy to use. All right, so the interior-wise, Rocky Ridge paints all this dash work down through here through the center console. Uh, this does have the 8.4-inch uh, touchscreen radio with Sirius XM and navigation, heated seats and steering wheel in here, and you can control the air conditioning and seat controls and some volume and tuning for your radio right here. So you can do it here with buttons or here with technology. It suits both people. You've got power windows, uh, media center here, I like to put my phone right there for Wranglers. It fits nicely. Doesn't get all banged up. Keyless entry with remote start. Steering wheel's heated with in leather wrapped. Uh, cruise control, hands-free connectivity for your cell phone. Automatic headlights, power uh, mirrors and locks. And uh, programs up here for your garage doors. All right, we've waited long enough. Let's open this bad boy up. So I noticed uh, it's really quiet. In the past, when uh, I've touched your vehicles with a uh, Sky One Touch, it's, it's kind of noisy like a soft top is, uh, which I guess is to be expected. So I don't know what they did for 23. I haven't researched it, but they're a lot quieter, which is always good. So uh, pretty cool, isn't it? I'll go ahead and close it. You can see it coming closed. Again, I... If you've ever taken a soft top up and down, or even just the T-tops and the hard tops, this is so easy, and you can do it while you're driving up to a certain speed limit, uh, so it's pretty cool. I really like it, really like it. I think it's worth the money. Uh, give us a call. Uh, this one probably be sold, unfortunately, by the time you see this video. If not, uh, definitely jump on it. But if it is, give us a call. Uh, see if we can find one for you, or maybe order a special one for you. We'd be happy to dig in and do the work for you. As always, check out our inventory. We've got great selection of lifted Jeep Wranglers and Gladiators and Ram pickup trucks in stock, ready to go. So take a look at our current inventory. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you really like this truck. Let me know down in the comments what you think. I think it's cool. The Tuscadero was a color I personally couldn't see myself driving, but I think this rain, I think I could see myself driving it. Just on the way over here, I drove across town to do the video, and like three people waved at me. Uh, I was like, oh. People are looking at this. It's, it's pretty cool. Take care. Bye-bye.